It is May 7th and I didn't vlog yesterday because it was actually wedding day. So I wasn't able to record anything because I was basically the assistant of the bride and I was helping her like crazy, helping her change into different outfits and everything. So today I'm finally vlogging and someone is staring at me so I'm just going to turn it around for you guys to see. They are right there staring at me vlogging but you know I'm pretending that I'm talking to myself but they're actually just standing behind there staring at me. So we are in this very sketchy mall right now to buy things to bring home so I'm gonna show you guys what it is. So this is what it looks like. They weigh it by grams and whatever you pick you just weigh it out and pay for it. So we just bought that right there and some chili pepper right there and she's weighing in. This mall gives a very different vibe from the Eon mall that I was at the other day which I vlogged. Um, this mall is very kind of dirty, sketchy, and a little weird. Stuff over there and they are wrapping it up in really nice paper and packaging to preserve it. Yeah. So we bought some of the dried squid right there and she is packing it up for us. Bought so far, this is a dried cuttlefish, dried cuttlefish, more dried cuttlefish, um, cuttlefish, and these are dried seasoned fish. This is, I think, I don't know what they're called in English, but they're just like really salty raisin wannabes. This, I think. The most expensive so far is like this dried cuttlefish. Um, All together, four of these were like fifty dollars. Chili pepper, salty chili pepper. So we have it in this, and they wrap it all together to preserve it. now and they have a ton of stuff and it's extremely hot in here so I'm actually going to probably pass out or something but this is what it looks like up here we were in the food department earlier but now it's the clothing So we weren't satisfied with the other mall because it was sketchy and a little weird and out of place for us. So we are back at Eon Mall going to Daiso and eating so we can get gifts and everything else. So we are finding food right now and I found the Pizza Hut. So I want to go there because it sounds really good. Here's my little sister, the annoying child and my aunt and my mother and uncle wherever he is so yeah we're going to pizza hut and the pizza hut hopefully it's the same as the american pizza hut so this is their menu they have a flowery looking pizza and the normal ones are in the back so this is the basic this is like the most basic pizza and this is what i want i want a cheese and a pepperoni so I don't know what they're going to choose, but I just want a basic pizza because I miss American food. So we bought two large pizzas. One is a cheese and one is a pepperoni, a salad, and one Sprite because I have my drink in my bag. And I think they bought two soups as well. So we're hungry and it's like a 20 minute wait. So 
Mimosa. So the pizzas came and they look like this. I mean, it looks like a normal pizza. But I'm going to taste test it to see if it actually tastes like normal pizza. So I am tasting the pepperoni pizza first. It tastes exactly the same. No difference. So we finished eating pizza and we took a box to go because we ordered too much food. So now we are finally gonna go to Daiso and this other really cheap like stationery store. We have so much stuff here. Like these pens right here. I think that converts to, I know that's less than a dollar. So this is crazy. Look at all of the cute erasers they have and the scissors. All this stuff is just super cute. This is even cheaper than Daiso actually. Look at all of the pens they have. They have a huge variety and this is all the sale items. Super, super cheap. So I have a ton of the five cent ones. I'm probably gonna grab more actually. Red, blue, black. I have a ton of stuff right here and apparently these are like less than a dollar. They're really cheap so I'm going to buy a ton of them as gifts um, for teachers and maybe My friends teacher. but I only have guy friends and I'm pretty sure they won't like any of this. So I will convert all the prices but this is the total. And we bought a ton of stationery, including uh, pens and a lot of sticky notes. So I'll put the price right here, but this is the total in Vietnam dollars. So compared to the other day that I went to this mall, it is super empty today and it feels so much nicer. The other day, yeah, it was fun, but it was super packed. So I didn't like it as much because I don't like being around like crowded places and a lot of people. So since it's so empty today, I feel free and I can do whatever I want and actually look for stuff that I want. So now we are about to head into Daiso and that is my favorite store here. So let's go on this adventure together. Daiso, my favorite store ever. So the first thing I found is a clear umbrella. I've been looking for this. Well, both my sister and I have been looking for this to take pictures with. I couldn't find it anywhere, but this is like the cheapest place to find a clear umbrella to take pictures. So I'm buying this. There are more of these sumo wrestler ones and ninja or whatever these are. So I am buying more of these. So I am looking at doggy clothes right now and literally everything is in a medium or an extra small. My two dogs are pretty fat so these won't fit them whatsoever and I'm kind of sad because I really wanted to, to buy them like this shirt. I have two boxes for teachers as gifts to like put their stickies and stuff in and then I have two doggy toys for my pups at home, a froggy one and a panda one. Look at how cute these little sponges are. They have little smileys on them. I love this store because of this. Look, a sponge with a smiley face. Is a sponge with a smiley face necessary? Not necessarily, but it's so cute and you just can't resist buying this stuff. So I just have like a ton of stuff in my hands. They're kind of full, but I need one hand for vlogging. So I'm trying not to buy anything else because I don't think I need any of this. We're getting ice cream at the same fried chicken spot, so yeah. We got soft serve ice cream. And it doesn't taste like regular soft serve ice cream, it tastes like... Cream from like one of those cream puffs. It just tastes like that cream more sweet than normal 
and more soft than normal. So we finished eating our ice cream and we have our stuff and we are heading to the grocery part of the mall which is the grocery store that we went to last time with a ton of stuff like the bakery and the sushi stuff. So we are going there again to get like sugar, salt, that stuff like just basic household items that you need. There are literally people in every single aisle promoting stuff. So like Downey has a person, this is Tide, and then there are like other people. I think this one's another one. So all of them are dressed in like a similar, a very similar outfit, like promoting or promoting their own brand. See, she's um, putting the stuff and promoting the stuff for this aisle. It's crazy. So we are in the Japanese aisle right now with all of the noodles. So I'm just going to pick a couple. Um, I don't really know what looks good. None of them looks appetizing to me yet, so we'll see. So we have two cart full of stuff, so we're about to finally head home. This is how long the receipt is. This is super, super long. So it is midnight. I am exhausted. I usually sleep at like 8 at night, but it's midnight now. I got home around like 10. No, I got home at around like 11. And then I studied with my cousin for an hour because he has an English exam. So we were studying for a bit. So now I am finally going to shower, wash off this face of makeup, and go to bed. I'm going to knock out until like 8 in the morning tomorrow. So I'm going to end the vlog here. Tomorrow I will do a huge, huge haul on what I got today. So I will talk to you guys in the next vlog. Bye!